Hey screen printers, it's Jeff from Slant the Stampinator, and today we're gonna to talk about our new product, the Manual Stampinator, the Stampinator M. All right, so we're running a 230 mesh. We're printing our white underbase. So we're gonna run this under the stamp. Time is actually set at two seconds for matting the fibers and gelling over that ink. Let's talk about a final cure with Stampinator M. So if you're running your pallets with a gum rubber, the heat's gonna reflect back up through the garment. That's gonna allow that heat to really give you that final cure. It just enhances that temperature a little bit more. So we're using a standard plastisol at 330 cure. We have our stamp set at 330 and we stamped it for seven seconds. We're gonna bring it around. We'll do our stretch test to see if we have that cure, your final print using the Stampinator M. So if you're printing, in this case, eight colors, it mats down those fibers, it gives you a super smooth surface, and you're printing it with ease. When using the Stampinator M, and you wanna do a DTF transfer on your manual press, we have these top covers that go right on top. We have a transfer ready to go for DTF transfers. You wanna make sure that you have your temperature set accordingly and your time, as well as your air pressure. Anywhere from 60 to 70 pounds of pressure for best results. We're gonna increase our time up to 12 seconds. The transfer that we're using today is a hot peel, so we wanna peel it fairly quickly. And like any other DTF transfer, you wanna take that back for the post hit. And I like to hit that for about six seconds, half the time from what we originally hit. But again, manufacturer's recommendations. There's your DTF transfer using the Stampinator M. One of the great things about using a DTF transfer today is the consumer doesn't really know the difference between a transfer and a screen print. So when you're printing in your shop and you have limited access to employees and manpower to get the job done, a lot of times it's pretty convenient to go into a DTF transfer. I like to run DTF transfers from 72 pieces down. It's a great product and the end result is fantastic. It's super soft, super smooth, and one of the great things is when you do your artwork based on the shirt that you're doing, you can punch out the negative space. So if you're using a black shirt, you have black ink, punch out the black, it'll give you even a better hand on your transfer. So if you have a manual press in your shop or you're a manual printer, remember the Stampinator M is the perfect product. You can print matte fibers on your underbase, you can cure on press, you can apply a DTF transfer. So with the Stampinator M, make your prints better.